Always stay positive, avoid being negative. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. With that bell if you haven't. I'm rapping and dancing for all the cool kids and for all the adults telling y'all that we can do this. Stay confident cause you can do it. And I love to play b-ball with my mom, now let's get it. Yeah! My thoughts on the presidential debates. Hello everybody. It's your girl Natia T, about to share her thoughts on the debating between Donald Trump and Joe Biden. This event happened on Tuesday of September the 29th, 2020. Okay, here I go. Well, first things first. The biggest question of all, who opened the economy? Who brought it back alive? Trump will make America great again. Donald Trump did. Thank you. See, people don't understand a lot of things. But one thing is very clear, that Trump opened the economy again, even though he had to shut it down because of COVID. But our economy is back open again. Joe Biden is the one that wanted it to be shut down and stay shut down from the very beginning. And I don't think he really cares about the American people. I will say this, Trump is trying to give us hope in saying that the show must go on. While on the other hand, Joe Biden wants everything to be shut down. He doesn't even want the schools to be open, which isn't good. Cause kids gotta learn and get their education. See, Joe Biden is always filling people's heads up with a whole bunch of nonsense. But we must look into reality that he's not the man he says he is. That this man isn't who he says he is. He's a fake. He is a hypocrite. He's got a lot of people fooled. He's not going to do right by our country. No way. He's trying to make our economy fall apart. You got to pay attention. Now some of you might agree with me. And maybe not. But that's okay. If you disagree. Because everybody's entitled to their own opinion. But the truth has to come out sooner or later. They're always saying that Trump is a bad man. He doesn't care, but that's not even true. The man has a lot on his plate, and people be blaming him for everything that he doesn't even have control over. Like what happened to George Floyd and Breonna Taylor. Trump didn't know that was going to happen to them. I hate how people think Trump has control over everything that happens every second in life. He's our president, but he's not God. People are blaming him for people losing their lives because of COVID. I mean, the man is doing his very best. He got ventilators out and a whole bunch of beds out and having a ton of doctors standing up and working hard and doing all they can to save the people. But there's so much a person can do. They act like Donald Trump is 10 people. He's one person. Joe Biden doesn't even have the right mindset to ever become president. I couldn't even see him even running this country. There's no way. I feel like everything that comes out of his mouth, he tries to play it off, but it's just a whole bunch of lies. He sugarcoats a lot. It's like I can see right through him. He's making people believe all these bad things about Trump. That Donald Trump is supposed to be racism. Yeah, right. How can that be true? Donald Trump has always put America first. And the people first. I mean, that's what it's all about. Of course, all the Mexicans are going against him. But Donald Trump doesn't want people that are illegal to come in our country and take advantage. It's not right and it's not fair. During the whole entire time, they said Trump kept cutting bite him off. Well, I would cut him off too if he's talking about a whole bunch of nonsense. At least Trump talks with a heart. With heart, meaning he gets down to the main stuff about our world and what he does and have did for our country. I think he's doing a good job. I mean, he's not perfect. Of course, no one is. But I don't think he's the worst president that we ever had. No, not at all. And people will vote for Biden all because they don't like Donald Trump. Like, really? Have a good reason. Is it because you're not a Republican or something else? It doesn't matter. If you're a Democrat, just get to the solution. Biden is the one that wants to raise taxes. He says Donald Trump doesn't care about the health care. Oh, please. Donald Trump has done more for this country than Biden will ever do. 
I voted for Trump when I was in high school, and I will vote for him again. And when I was watching the debating, Biden was laughing and looking down a lot. Like, this is a joke, while Donald Trump had that serious look, like he always has. He have had so many meetings and conferences and stuff thrown at him. One thing I can say about Donald Trump, he's not afraid to speak his piece about anything. This man can talk for hours and hours. People say Trump never lets no one speak. Well, why should he if they not making sense? He doesn't have time to listen to what's not right for this country. He is a very intelligent and clever man that has so much knowledge. Biden says Trump doesn't have a plan, but Trump will prove him wrong over and over again. Biden has nothing on Trump. He was stuttering when he was speaking. He acted like he couldn't remember what he was saying. He would continue saying the same things that Donald Trump is the reason why people lost their loved ones and why the economy is not getting better. He will say anything to make Trump look bad, but our president is one step ahead. I'm closing it out by saying this, Biden, I don't think you're going to win. You don't even have a shot at beating Trump. No way. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Please type me down below who you want to win or think that's going to win. And please type your opinions down below on what do you think about this debate and what do you think about my video. Peace. You're going to TOT out. Thanks for watching.